What is up everyone? This is your boy Eddie here on Texas Reeling. I hope you guys are staying safe out there and today guys this is more of a how-to video. It's, uh, it's that time of the year for me to go ahead and tune up my trolling motor and uh, get it right. A lot of people don't know about this so I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys how I'm gonna tune it up to get the best power out of it. It's super simple. All you're gonna need is two tools. That's all you're gonna need. Now I have a Minn Kota Edge 45 pound thrust this will work on just about any kind of trolling motor from Minn Kota even to motor guide trolling motors so I'm gonna get the camera set up so you guys can see what I do and I, I'll kind of walk you guys through it and explain what I'm doing while I'm doing it so let me get the camera set up so you guys can get a different angle of my trolling motor and then uh, we'll get started alright guys so I have you guys in view just so you guys can see the trolling motor so you guys can see what I'm doing first off you're gonna have a, a, a bolt right here or a nut you're gonna have it right here you're gonna want to take that off and I'm using a half inch right here a half inch socket you just want to take that bolt off washer off give this a little nudge there's your prop that'll come right off slides right off put that to the side now you're gonna have two screws right here guys one on top one on bottom I have a 1 fourth inch right here to take it off all you're gonna want to do is loosen those guys you don't have to take them all the way off there's no reason to take them all the way off. Don't take them. Just you just want to loosen them. Loosen them just a bit, enough for it to move, move uh, nicely. Make sure your trolling motor's off. Make sure everything is turned off. You're, you don't need it on right now. You'll need it on in a little bit, but not yet. So I got that loosened up. Okay. Now you guys see how I can move this. Once you loosen these two screws up, it'll loosen this whole this whole thing right here will get loose. What you want to do is you want now you want to turn your trolling motor on manual and put it at a, we'll put it at mine is one through five speeds. I'll put it on three, which is about halfway. And you want to hit it. Now as you can, I don't know if you guys can hear that. Let me zoom you guys in a little bit. But you can see it when I hit it. It spins. See this thing right here spinning? Now right now it's not getting the maximum speed that I want. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually just leave it turned on. I'm going to hit it. And while I do that, you kind of just want to turn this. And now right there it started picking up more speed. So that tells me that it was kind of off balance. Let me show you guys again. So, if, there we go. Let me crank it up a little more. You guys hear that? How you can hear the power coming out of it? I feel like right there would be the spot where I'm getting the most out of it. You turn it back down, mess with it. Yeah, that sounds sounds like a good spot. All you're gonna do once you have it lined up where, where you feel like it has the most power, you're going to get your, oh, and screw it back on there. Tighten that up a little, tighten this up a little bit, go back up here, finish tightening it up. Back down here, tighten that up. Now you guys can hear that humming sound. It sounds a lot more powerful than it did before I loosened these up. That 
sounds like it's, uh, it's pretty good right there. Now you want to get your uh, your prop. Your prop was most most trolling models will have these two little slips on there, and on your prop it has them too. So that's how you know what, how to line it back up if you've never took one off. Just line them back up. Pop it back on there. Get your washer. Bolt. Screw it back on. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. I hope you guys can take something from it. You guys should definitely try it. If you guys try it and it works for you, go down there in the comments, let me know how it does. Um, don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you're not yet subscribed. If you're new to the channel, I have fishing videos. Make sure you check those out. Thank you guys for watching. And don't forget to keep it real. It's your boy Eddie and I'm out. Peace.